So I'm here at uh, Star, or not Stars, what that, the Sonic down the road from my house. I just had a funny thought. I was listening to some White Lion. That was always been one of my favorite bands from the 80s, is freaking White Lion. Mike Tramp on vocals, Grave D'Angelo. I can't remember the name of the bassist, forgive me. And Vito Brada, incredible Vito Brada on guitar. I call it Vito Brada the, the anti Ingve because he said in an interview when he was learning guitar, who his influences were obviously Van Halen, and he was more influenced actually by K.K. Downing of Judas Priest, even though his playing doesn't sound anything like that, um, than he was Van Halen. A lot of people thought he sounded like Van Halen. He says with Ingve Malmsteen, that was an example of what not to do. He goes, not because I didn't like Ingve, but I knew I'd never achieve that level of playing, which Vito was one of the best guitar players in the world ever. So he took it in the opposite direction. He said when he went met Van Halen, he finally met Eddie Van Halen. He, he just bawled, crying. Eddie Van Halen gave him a hug and says, I totally get it. And dude, honestly, I cried when I saw Ingve.